when I was making a Flash cartoon uh, recently, it uh, the audio went out of sync on me, and I could took me ages to figure out how to fix it. And it turns out that it's a compression that you use or the frame rate that you use to do it. And there's a known flaw in Flash where I think it's two frames for every 1,000 can fall out of sync. It's like a, when you use MP3, it's like a, it's, a, I know, it's an issue. Anyway, so I haven't fixed it. So uh, what I'm going to do is show you how I did it. Now the cutting I made is quite small. It only goes for just over a minute. So uh, the way at the first method, uh, apparently it really increases file size, but for me it wasn't it wasn't so bad. It wasn't didn't make it huge or anything. So I was still okay. So if you have something a lot longer than that, maybe you want to try the second method, which apparently doesn't affect file size, and you can keep it as MP3. Okay, so the first method is to change the compression rate. Uh, to do that, open up your movie and go to File, Publish Settings. And you'll see the audio stream, and you want to drop that compression there and change it to ADPCM. And for me, it worked straight away. You remember in the timeline, when you play it back in the timeline, it works fine. No, nothing wrong. But when you publish it, or export it, sorry, when you export it, uh, then the issue comes out. And for me, it hit uh, frame number 1263. I think it was, and right there, there actually, uh, and then it fell out of sync, and uh, it was really, really annoying. So the uh, other way to do it, to make it so you don't, so you don't blow out your file size, click on the uh, the outside the stage, so just behind the stage. So you make sure you're not on the stage, outside the stage, and you get your document properties up here, and you want to go down to frames per second, and click on that, and you want to make it. 23.95, so 23.95, and that frame rate uh, fixes the problem because it's every two frames per 1,000, so it'll actually it, like levels it all out, and you leave the compression lane. So up here you won't you won't do any of this. So you'll leave that compression at MP3, but you'll change that to 23.3, 23.95. So that would be uh, uh, MP3. Um, so yeah, it's one or the other. So, uh, and that's it. So remember, if you've got it set to ADPCM, then make sure that is 24 frames per second. And you're done. Thanks for watching.